How would you like to crush your goals for 2023? How would you like to make it your best year ever? At the time that I'm recording this video, we are six months away from the end of the year. And I wanna ask you, how did the first part of your year go? Did you hit the goals that you wanted to hit so that you can now make the money that you want by the end of the year? Well, today I wanna to talk to you about how to crush any goal that you set your mind to. So very quickly, if you don't know who I am, my name is Ann Carden. I'm a top business growth strategist and coach, and I work with coaches, consultants, and professional entrepreneurs who have big dreams, big goals, and they want to build a really high-end premium business. So they, they want a business that actually makes them more money working less time. If that's you, you can reach out to me at acarden.com and we can have a conversation around how you can do this in your business. All right, how can you crush your goals? We're halfway through the year and I wanna share with you four things that you can do so that you can hit whatever goal you want. Now, the first thing is to get really clear on your goal. What is that? And is it going to be realistic? So if you don't have the strategies or you don't have any idea how to hit the goal, then you might want to have a more realistic goal. But I want to encourage you to stretch yourself. See, often I see coaches, consultants, entrepreneurs say, oh, I want to make a half a million dollars or oh, I want a seven figure business. But there's no seriousness behind it. It just sounds good, right? And that's not going to help you hit the big goals. The first thing that you have to do is really figure out what is that goal and then reverse engineer and what do you actually need to make that happen? So this is where you want to lay out the strategy to make sure that you can hit that. Now, one of the things that I recommend is to break that goal into bite-sized chunks. So we have two more quarters left in the year. What do you need to accomplish each one of those quarters? And then break that down by months. What do you need to accomplish in each month and break it down even further into weeks and even days. When you do this, it will help you stay on course. It will help you stay committed and focused to reaching that goal. See, often people don't hit goals because they have this big overall goal that they want to accomplish, but they never actually reverse engineer and break down the steps that can help them get there. So that's the very first thing is what is that goal? Break it down into those bite-sized chunks. And then even what do you need to accomplish every single day? The second thing is be committed to the goal. It's not enough just to set a goal and then kind of be lazy about trying to achieve it. So be super committed to the goal. If you're going to hear it, if you're going to hit it, you've got to commit to it. And I see so many people that, again, they set a goal, but there's no real reason why they set that goal, why they want to accomplish that. And so because of that, there's also no commitment. See, often people think that we have all the time in the world. I know for years I thought this. Oh, I have years. I have all the time in the world. But the reality is we don't. And here's why we don't. Because for all of the time that you're taking to take the slow path, to try to hit the goal that you think you want to achieve, there are other people coming into the market who are crushing it, who are blowing things out of the water. And so sitting there and taking your time is not going to help you be able to really be highly successful. And the other thing, and I've said this for so many years, money loves speed. And part of the reason why entrepreneurs don't hit their goals and part of the reason why many of them don't succeed the way they can is because they don't have this urgency in their business. And so you have to create this urgency in your business. That's why I love things with timelines on them. For example, I said to you, what if you could crush your goals by the end of the year? That's a very specific time frame, right? Six months is all you have. And then I said, break it down quarterly and break it down monthly and break it down weekly and even daily. Because when you do that, now you create the subconscious urgency to hit your goals. So get committed to the goal. First, set the goals, set that, reverse engineer, put the steps in place, 
then get committed to the goal and really treat your goal as something with some urgency, right? And I always say, if you don't hit it this week, then you've got to add this week's goal onto next week's goal, right? Or you're not going to hit your goal by the end of the year. So are you doing this? Are you treating your business this way? I think so often people just say a number, they just throw a number out there, they just think, oh, this sounds good, but there's no real reason why they want to even accomplish that goal to begin with. So the first is set the goal. The second is reverse engineer, get committed to the goal and treat it with urgency. You don't have all the time in the world. We don't ever know when we can no longer do this. We don't ever know when something might happen in our life, right? That will take us off course. We don't even know when we will leave this earth. And so you have to live every day and treat every day like it's the most important day. And if the important thing for you at this moment is to grow your business and you have this fire in your belly to be able to do that, then you've got to get serious about being able to accomplish that goal. Recently, I in my mastermind, I said, Okay, I want to know the goal that everyone's going to hit by the end of summer. And the really cool thing is most of my clients are they crushed it in the first month of summer because they got focused, they got serious, they got committed. And that's really what it takes to hit the goals. See, they have all the strategies they need and they have my support and guidance. But what I can't help them do is go after it. I can't help them be so committed and so focused. I can guide them along the way. I can give them even what their next step is and how to even shift or uh, course correct if something's not working, but they have all the strategies. But what I can't do is is do it for them or I won't do it for them, right? And so when I got them really focused and really excited and really pumped up, many of them hit their goal in the first month. And I know that you can do this too. What if you could hit your 2023 goal in the in the next quarter, right? So stretch yourself. Think big, go bigger, then put this urgency behind that goal. The other thing is to make sure that you have the strategies to be able to hit the goal and to make sure that you have the help if you need help to be able to hit those goals. See, if you don't have the strategies and you don't have the goal and you don't have the help, but you have the desire and you have the commitment, well, it's again, not going to be likely that you hit that. So all of these things are pieces of being able to hit that goal. But most people don't and most people don't succeed the way they could because they haven't done these few things. So I hope this encourages you to have the biggest 2023 that you have ever had in your business and really go all in, get committed, get serious, get on it and treat it with urgency. And then you can identify what do you still need? What don't you have? What don't you know? So you can't identify gaps in your business if you don't even know where you're going. You can't hit a target that you cannot see. You've got to be able to see it. And then you've got to take the actions to make it happen. So I'm committed to making 2023 my best year ever. And I want to encourage you to commit to the same thing. Let's do this. Let's do it together. And if you need some help doing this, maybe you don't have the strategy. Maybe you don't have the support. Maybe you're just not even really sure how to hit that big goal that you want. Well, then book a call with me at acarden.com and let's map out your plan. Let's map out your game plan so you can go all in and really create that dream, really make that dream happen that you have. Don't just talk about it. That doesn't help you and that's not going to accomplish anything. It's not enough just to say it. You've also got to put the actions in place and you've got to get serious and focused and committed and go all in. So I hope you'll drive towards that goal and best of luck to you. And again, if I can help you, book a call with me at acard.com. God bless you. Have an amazing day. Bye-bye.